the chaos continues. Good morning, everybody. It is Boy Mum on a Budget here, or Jay. I am here with the usual crowd, the big boy, Ashton, Ollie, and Fletchy. Not feeling too great. Little boys did not have the best night or the best start to the morning, so hence looking like shit. Do I look like shit all the time anyway? Yeah, pretty much. I'll use that as an extra excuse. This morning, we are doing some laundry. I'm going to try and fold some clothes and get a heap of washing done. I did put a load on last night and I put the dishwasher on last night, even though it was peak time for electricity. So that's probably not the best choice I've ever made in my life. I was able to vacuum and mop the floors last night. So that's good. I'm happy about that. Even though now we're doing things like eating cream biscuits and putting crap everywhere again. This morning, the big thing that we are doing, hopefully, fingers crossed, is going down to Logan Village to King's Church because they have a free hamper that they give away once a month, which is a few bags of things like pantry staples, non-perishables, fruit and veg, and lots of bread. They're so generous and they're so friendly. Like when you go to the church, they've got refreshments, coffee, tea, all of that sort of thing. They've got baked goods. Last time I just sat and ate scrolls and had a chat with some lovely ladies. I really want to go and grab it and Lee is at work. So if everything is going all right, I'll be going and getting it. Cream Bicky. As you can tell, I have my child's best interests at heart with food. <laughs> Hi, here I am once again. Um, I've actually gotten dressed in something kind of respectful, but then I have spilt stuff on it, so. We ain't hauling on the change mat today. No, no, we are hauling on the table. Yeah, it's bad having you in the background. Well, we do that. <laughs> I am coming to you with our King's Church Hall. I managed to get the kids in the car by 10.30. It was finishing at 11. We really want to take the kids and um, have a bit of a social gathering there sometime because they've got like tea and coffee and refreshments and oh my God. What is going on in here? That's a little bit loud. Got the haul, it was four shopping bags, not like, you know, fully packed to the brim or anything, but we've got a pretty decent haul here for you guys and you will see it in the thumbnail as well anyway, the picture of it. I've actually set it up on the table, not the change mat for once. I will go through what we got because it is going to be a big help for us. One of our favorite things about this hamper is all the bread that you get given. You usually get at least two loaves of bread and then like a couple of types of rolls. So we got today two loaves of bread. Over there in my extremely messy kitchen is a loaf of wholemeal. So yeah, we got a wholemeal loaf, a white loaf, we got some jumbo hot dog rolls, a six pack. So tomorrow we're gonna have hot dogs for lunch. And we got a six pack of super soft jumbo round rolls, which is going to be part of our dinner tonight. I have taken out the leftover bolognese mints from the other night when I did spaghetti bolognese. And we're just gonna have that on rolls. So kind of like sloppy joes, I guess, but with like a bolognese mince mix we got some biscuit now same sort of deal uh, as my pantry clean out the other week i'm actually going to donate some of this stuff not a lot but to the free community like pantry thing that we've got going on down the road because ashton's just not eating these ones anymore like he doesn't mind the pizza ones but he doesn't really 
he's not really interested in any of them anymore. Hang on, we've got to have some sort of mediation in here. What's going on? What happened? Tell mummy what's wrong. You hurt your finger. All right, so Ashton's just not really eating these anymore. So we're going to be donating that. And we've got some single packets of that as well. It's the Coco Oat Bluey Bickies. So really good for kids. Yeah, so hopefully that can help out a family. Some of these biscuits, fig and black olive, they're a little bit gourmet. I'm not sure. Don't drive your truck on the cabbage, darling. I'm not sure if Lee will want these or whether we will donate them. Okay, we have one, one of these cute little lemon drizzle square things from Fiber One. And last time, I'm pretty sure um, Ashton ate it. But, I mean, it's best before, like, nearly a year ago and it's all squished. So, I don't know. Now we've got some of these butterscotch lollies. I don't know. Lee might want them. Otherwise, we'll probably donate them. I really don't, like, especially after doing the pantry clean out, I really don't want a lot of clutter or I don't want things that we go, oh, yeah. That's good, but then they just sit in the pantry for a million years, so we'll just see how we go. We got two of these bolognese sauces, which again is great, but I'm almost certain that I'll donate just because we basically make our own bolognese sauce. Two tins of spaghetti, which is great, and a tin of baked beans, also great because the kids and I have them on toast. We got two long life full cream milks. Still very much in date, so I'm probably going to give them to mum and dad because dad usually drinks long life whole, like full milk, full cream milk. We got uh, two tins of corn kernels again, which is going to be a great help with our uh, budget meal planning this week. Hello, look at you, aren't you beautiful? You're the only well behaved one, aren't you, Ollie? Okay, so tin of corn, um, there's two of them, so that'll be really good. We've got heaps in the pantry already, but we're doing cheesy chicken enchiladas this week from Feeding Five Frugally, I believe her Instagram handle is. So definitely look her up. Really good frugal meal, family of five, just like us. So that's, you know, part of my seven nights of budget dinners that I'm putting together. We've got one of these. We've been doing one of these every now and then with some chicken, veggies, like stir fry veggies and rice, which is delish. A couple of muesli bars, probably going to donate them just because no one in the family really eats them. Got lots of uh, whingy kids here today. They're all supposed to be sick, but you know, they're all being feral at the same time. Lenin <laughs> just thinks Ashton's so hilarious. Try to ignore the chaos that is behind me with TV and children. Got a few more things to show you guys and then that'll be it, I suppose. So yeah, there's a strawberry jam. We got that one last time. I think I gave it away. I'm not sure. If I did, we might keep this one. But if I didn't give it away last time, we'll probably give this one away because we don't really need two, but we're probably needing a strawberry jam soon. Tin veggies. Don't really know if we would use those because we have frozen ones. So we'll just see how we go. These little petite pavlova things. Tartare sauce, which is great because we've got lots of fish. Baby beets, our fave. A random already opened chocolate topping so I don't really know what's going on there we got a couple of cereals so we got a sustain and we got a just right so that's cool I don't mind a bit of cereal some sugar a couple of tea bags which is always good little pack of grain waves that's the best flavor uh, and actually well that and cheddar is like they probably tie a couple of packs of pasta I'll either donate this or I'm actually doing a uh, colored pasta sensory activity so I think yeah that's kind of all the pantry stuff uh, yep rolled oats I'm not sure if I said that before but rolled oats always good because I've got to have um, overnight oats I haven't really got back into that yet but hopefully I will some little um, snacky things here. I think Lee liked them last time. Now we have some fruit and veg. So we've basically got a whole cabbage here. We've got two halves, which is great. A couple of apples, a tomato, a couple of onions, some red potatoes. These are the best potatoes. And we haven't bought them for a little while because they're quite expensive at Coles. We got uh, three carrots, five bananas, which is great because that's basically how the babies eat their bananas and they eat a banana each every day at least. And we got uh, half a dozen 
mandarins so that's good and we've got a little baby white potato there too so four potatoes hopefully i didn't rush through that too much but that's the king's church at logan village that's the free uh it costs nothing it's a free hamper that they give to you you fill out a little form giving some details like literally just like your name and you know how many people in your family and that sort of thing i guess so that they know how much and what sort of foods to give you because you know they give you some things for the kids and stuff as well but yeah all in all some really good things that's going to help us out a lot in the coming days this sort of thing is what really helps us and we are really thankful for it we are heading to our local fresh and save at eagleby probably tomorrow though because i think we've kind of reached our limit of adulting today because we've had ridiculous weeks with just sickness and no sleep and everything else lee worked this morning i had the babies i had screaming i had vomiting i had all sorts of bullshit happening before six o'clock this morning. So we're done. We're gonna be chilling for the rest of the day. Tomorrow we're gonna go to Fresh and Say. That is the video. I'm gonna shut up now. Bye everybody. Bye. See you in the next video. Ashton's like, huh? <laughs> okay, thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and like and comment if you have anything to say. Make it nice though, because I'm sensitive. I will see you in the next video. Thank you.